The losses not only marked the end of the season, but also the end of Elon basketball's time in the Southern Conference. Our Rajat Agarwal was in Asheville this weekend and found out more. Elon became a member of the Southern Conference in 2003. Now 11 years later, Elon took the court for the final time as a member of the SOCON. <laughs> With that sound, the Elon basketball program said goodbye. Both the men's and women's basketball teams entered the 2014 Southern Conference Tournament knowing it would be their last. For women's head coach Charlotte Smith, the years in the SOCON were a treat. I just loved it, you know, because it was like you had to be mentally sharp and mentally focused. Every night you had to be prepared to fight. Perhaps the biggest supporter of Elon basketball through the years has been longtime Elon legend Dr. Earl Danley, who gave the SOCON one final famous towel wave. I've been in the various conferences over the years at Elon. I think that the Southern Conference has been one of the best affiliations we have had. The Southern Conference Tournament has now been hosted in Asheville for the past three seasons, and Elon has embraced it. Asheville is a great place to have the tournament. I've enjoyed being here. I'm surprised and pleased with the great number of Elon fans who come to Asheville for the tournament. In the time that Elon has spent in the conference, it has seen tremendous growth across the board. I think our programs have improved since we've been in the Southern Conference. There's some really fine institutions in the Southern Conference. The future of Elon Athletics is promising, and Dr. Danley is looking forward to it. I guess next year we'll be in Baltimore in a new conference and a new tournament. The Phoenix will move to the Colonial Athletic Association at the beginning of next season. For the final time in Asheville at the Southern Conference Basketball Tournament, Rajat Agarwal, Elon, Local News.